Hi, this is Mob Tactics and you're watching Blade Runners TV. So welcome in Budapest, how are you tonight? I'm not too bad, thank you very much. Thank you for having me. Uh, so yeah, last year you released the Body Check EP. Mm. Uh, when will be the first release this year? We've actually just finished our new single um, and that's going to be dropping middle of April. Uh, so the A-side is a track we've done with MC Nuclear uh, called Welcome to Your Nightmare. And then the other side of that is a VIP of Get Dirty, which we released at the beginning of 2016. So yeah, got a few remixes on the go as well. So yeah, lots of material on the way now. <laughs> uh, are you planning to make your first album soon? We are. We've kind of decided recently uh, on a release date. It's, it's going to be next year, but I guess yeah, we're going to this summer we're going to we're going to start writing an album, and yeah, I guess towards the end of next year, people can expect it to drop. What are the ups and downs working as a duo? <laughs> um, well, the ups are, are great because there's two of you. Um, you know, it kind of like we've always found when. When the energy drops of one person, the other person picks up the, the slack a little bit and it's just very good to kind of have someone who can like bounce ideas off and it just makes the creative process a lot more enjoyable. It's a lot more, you know, a lot more of a vibe if you like. The downsides are I guess sometimes you don't agree on the same thing, but we're kind of lucky touch wood that we agree on most things. So uh, yeah, not too many downsides, apart from he's a bit lazy making the drinks, but you know. How long do you know each other? Oh, we we met kind of nearly six years ago. Um, I was working for Chemical Records and I ran a couple of labels there and he was just kind of starting out making music and I liked kind of what I was hearing and I signed a few of his tracks on our label and he was like, I'll come down and do a tune with me and I went to his studio and we did a track and then he came to my studio and we did a track and yeah, just... So this is your first time here, uh, yes. what have you heard about the Hungarian parties, about the Blade Runners? I've heard a lot about Blade Runners, I mean like a lot and I've, I've been kind of looking at the stalking the pictures on Instagram for a while and I'm like, oh I want to play there. It's a good lineup tonight, so yeah I'm really excited to play, which is you know, 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any favourite track that was made by a Hungarian producer? That's tough. <coughs> I guess, um, I mean, I really like Jade and Mindscape, obviously, they're, they're amazing producers. Um, there was a couple of tracks on like, Mindscape's album, they did the commercial Suicide, that were just wicked, the track called Critters, that was like, yeah, I played that for a long, long, long time, and Stardust as well, which Jade did a remix of, funny enough. So yeah, I mean, yeah, the, the, the Hungarian music you know, that comes out of is, is awesome, it's kind of, it's up there, and I think those guys are like really flying the flag for the neuro sounds out of, out of hungry, so yeah. Any words of wisdom? <laughs> <laughs> um, words of wisdom? Oh, that's probably the wrong person to ask. <laughs> um, yeah, don't drink too much Red Bull. I stopped drinking so much Red Bull. I found it kind of makes me a bit a bit jittery. We used to drink a lot of it in the studio, and uh, we've recently banned it for a while. 